We're going to Midtown and then we're gonna take the Long Island, no, the Roosevelt Island Tramway, if we can figure that out. And yeah, so mom's here for the weekend and so we're gonna do some fun touristy stuff. Yep. And yeah, so we would go have an adventure. Yeah, because yeah. we don't ever do this stuff and I, we were like, we wanna do this. So yeah, we, we decided to just do it because it docks right near our place. So like we're two on. minutes, we walk well maybe three minutes. Yeah, we walk Got three on minutes. Boat, three minutes from her apartment. Yeah, so we're on the boat now. I'm gonna show you around. Okay, so we just got off the boat and it took about three minutes we from coast like to coast. Immigrants. We just came to America. <laughs> <laughs> off the, the East River Ferry and now we're gonna jump in a cab or something. Yeah. And we're gonna try to get to the Roosevelt tram. So we'll see you in a bit. A bit? We'll see you in a bit. In a bit. We'll see in you a in a minute. Minute. We'll see you in a mite. We'll see you in a minute. We are walking from the 34th Street point that we docked at. We are near the UN building and the traffic is crazy. So we are we're getting a little bit further before we get a cab, but if you look behind me, it's all police cars because the president is in town today. So they're being safe. Look at all these cars. It's all police and unmarked vehicles and things of that sort. You can see it's just like a jet and cops and things like that. Look at all these cops. Cops. So we're gonna keep on walking. And then when we get to the UN building, which you can see there, that really tall one, is the UN building. The president is there, and we're not looking for him. We just happen to be passing by it, so we're gonna keep on walking. We have made it to Grand Central. We walked here from the boat place. Here's the Chrysler building, way up there. for five years almost in October of five years and I've never been to Roosevelt Island so we're here now we're gonna look around a little bit first tram ride successful so now it's Got truly island life Okay, so we've been walking down the island a little bit. We're a little further down now, and we're getting all the steps on our jawbones. We all have jawbones. Let's get a shot of all of our jawbones. Hold up your wrist. So we're, we're getting our steps in. Get in here, Jet. Our jawbones. So now we are in the, what is this called? It's the FDR for points park. It's the FDR for something <laughs> park. 
<laughs> I looked at the sign. I was like, I'm going to remember this for the video. For Freedoms Park. And we are walking in front of this uh, abandoned, in, like, insane asylum building, which has always been one of my favorite buildings in New York. So here it is. It looks really small compared to what we thought very, from our window. Tiny. And from even just where I was before. It is a beautiful like building. We got neat architecture going yeah. on. Yeah. They make the best haunted, haunted house ever. Well, everyone thinks it's haunted. It's got to be haunted. Yeah, I think so too. So this is what it looked like back in the day. That's a picturesque ruin. So mom thinks that it wasn't really smallpox and that they just didn't want to advertise that it was for mental patients. Or that it was smallpox at one point and, it was and then turned into an insane asylum at another point maybe yeah Since or that vice seems versa to be the legend it could have been vice versa yeah and it it's, was named blackwells island it's also true that in like the 1800s they thought people were insane for having any kind of feelings well that's true so that's true i mean if you look up things like that you can read all kinds of weird legends about what people considered insane in the 1800s yeah, so they they considered promiscuity to be insane <laughs> yes okay now we are in the franklin d roosevelt for freedoms park and it is looking pretty cool it looks like dc over here look at all this white stone so we're gonna take a walk to the end and see where we live because we can see our apartment from here so let's take a walk about the four freedoms we have reached our destination <laughs> yes we have it took us so much longer than we thought all of the presidential traffic and whatnot took all the trains but we're here and now we have to talk about how we want to get home because we were originally gonna go back and retrace our steps and take the tram again and the boat again but we're really tired <laughs> so we may just take the train Take the train or figure something else out we'll see so now we're gonna sit here and look at the beautiful waves and figure out how we're gonna get home because our home is like right over there like it could if we could swim it it would take us like no time but no time it's over. can't swim the east river no we get up close and personal with this boat yeah yeah police boat if they could just give us a ride that would be seriously great. can we just hail a boat i know mm -hmm. 